So we're talking about the, the significance of the evening in spite, in, you know, in light of what happened two weeks ago. Yes. Does that add a different edge to... Uh, I was there. I was at the concert myself. Um, so yes, significant impact on my life. Uh, completely changed my perspective, actually. I feel like I'm so blessed and so grateful and I'm not wasting like any time um, just living life and really, really appreciative. I'm definitely going to be getting the Manchester Bee tattoo uh, to commemorate the 22 souls that we lost that evening because I, I feel very, very lucky that I'm here today. So I feel like Manchester suddenly got our community back though and I'm very, very passionate about that. And I've grown up here, you know, born and bred and there's something about Manchester that's very, very special and significant. And after that, I know it sounds awful, but something so tragic has brought life back to Manchester. And I feel like people can hear our hear our voices again, and and it matters. Yeah. We need to kind of like just remember those souls for the right reasons and and, and pay it forward. Uh, did, did you hear the explosion? Yeah, I was outside the station when it happened. Yeah. I don't, know, I don't know what to say to that. I, know. I think I'm slightly numb to it, to be fair. Um, I've had a lot of support around me. Work have been incredible. Coronation Street have been my backbone. And um, like I said, I think I'm just very appreciative of being here today. So I'm just going to keep my chin up and, um, and enjoy every day. Yeah, fantastic. Are you going to the concert tomorrow? I am. I am. I'm going to take my brother, who's my date this evening. And he is... Um, he actually saved me. He picked me up in the car. So it's going to be even more special that we're all there together tomorrow and just enjoy the fact that all the proceeds go back to We Love Manchester charity.